Damn, son, where'd you find this? All right, what's up, you guys? The Shader Gamer back with another video. You guys, hit the subscribe button because on this channel, we have Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl content for you guys to check out. I even made playlists to make it easier for you guys to go ahead and check out my content with one click of a button. So you guys, hit the subscribe button and join the Shade team today. So you guys, I got a video that I've been holding off doing. Because every time I plan on doing this video right here, other videos come up that I decide I want to do before I do this video right here. And the video is, should Nick Jr. characters be in the game? Now, originally... I was going to do a wish list of Nick Jr. characters I want to be in the game, but to be honest, it's not even that long of a list of characters I would want to be in the game if I even wanted Nick Jr. characters to be in the game. This is a topic that comes up a lot in my comment section. I have not ignored it. I just never made a video about it. Now, before I answer the question, if I personally think Nick Jr. characters should be in the game, I will now talk about the characters that would have been on the wish list if I would have made a wish list for Nick Jr. characters. I'm going to start off with Dora the Explorer and Diego. Now, growing up, I used to watch both of the shows, the Dora the Explorer show and Go Diego Go. I used to watch both of the shows. I enjoyed it when I was a kid. But, of course, as I got older, I stopped watching it. And I was watching other cartoons like Invader Zim, Avatar The Last Airbender, so on and so forth. All the other cartoons, right? Now, the thing about Diego and Dora being in the game is that... Yes, it would be cool for them to be in the game for nostalgia reasons for myself. But, at the same time, I never seen them fight. They not really fighters, to be honest. Like, if I'm wrong, please comment down below because I have not watched Dora Diego in a long time. So if I'm wrong, please let me know if they changed it up and Dora learned some Kung Fu or Diego started putting some boxing gloves on, giving people some hands. Because I'm just saying, I never seen them really fight. But for Nick Jr. characters, these would be two of the characters I would choose just because I have that nostalgia attachment to them for watching them as a child. Now, the next character that I have that a lot of people may not know is Sporticus from Lazy Town. Now, I know a lot of people may not know who Sporticus is, but Sporticus is part of the show called Lazy Town to where him and a girl named Stephanie, their plan was to try to make the city of Lazy Town to stop being lazy because everyone in the city was lazy they would just sit down and just eat chips and candy and do nothing and they had a villain named Robbie Rodden that was trying to make sure everybody stay lazy but Sporty Kids was this athletic freak that was trying to get people to exercise and drink water and eat healthy and everything and get people to stop being lazy that was his goal him and Stephanie now like I said Sporty Kids is an athletic freak right now, his moveset, you can actually make a moveset off of him just due to the fact that he was actually fast, he was strong, and you've seen feats of his ability to be able to jump and stuff like that, right? So, I think Sporticus would be a good character to have in Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl if they were looking at Nick Jr. characters. And maybe Stephanie too. Like, I guess you could throw her in there too as a female character from that same show. Now, I think that's a big stretch. I don't think that's going to ever happen. But, hey, I could be wrong. I think it would be cool they were put in there. Now, also, Blue's Clues. I want to talk about Blue's Clues just real quick. Blue's Clues is a character that I see a lot of people want in the game. But somebody do me a favor. Somebody just comment four moves you'll give Blue's Clues in the comment section. Because, to be honest, Blue's Clues is not a character I would really want in the game, really. Because it would just be weird seeing him going ahead and fighting people and stuff like that. Like, maybe as like an extra side character in the background or something like that, I guess. But, not really. Not for me, anyway. Now, to answer the question, do I want Nick Jr. characters in the game? Do I think they should be in the game? To be honest... Yes, but after other characters are put in the game that I personally want. Now, I know everybody got different characters that they really want in the game. And me, I would want everybody to have their favorite character in the game. But me personally, I think it would be more of a disservice if you don't put characters in like Jenny XJ9 or Jimmy Neutron before you put in Nick Jr. characters. Because those are characters that I feel like are more built for this game than Nick Jr. characters who don't really ever fight. And characters like Jimmy Neutron and even Timmy Turner are more of a staple stone when it comes to Nickelodeon 
than Nick Jr. characters. Like, I know Nick Jr. characters are very popular, and I think it would be cool if they have, like, a DLC pack, like, DLC pack 5 or something with the Nick Jr. characters in the game or something like that, but... To be honest, I feel like that other characters should be put as a priority before they are put in the game. But overall, I have no problem with it because I would want everybody to have any character that they really want in the game. That's, of course, Nickelodeon and even crossover characters too, I guess, you know, if they could get that done. But anyway, you guys, do me a favor. Comment down below and let me know what you think. Do you want Nick Jr. characters in the game? And if so, who do you want? And at least name one move you would give them in the game. But anyway, you guys, thank you guys for watching. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe. Make sure y'all subscribe because they got some big things coming to this channel for my subscribers. And you do not want to miss out. If you don't subscribe, you're going to miss out. But thank you guys for watching. Shout out to the Shade Team. And I'm out.